Hey, what's up everyone? Travis Patel here with Internet Biz Masters. And I thought I'd make a quick video and show you how to set up a product with the instant affiliate program here, JVZoo. And this uh, platform is really kind of becoming the, the best one to use, the most user friendly, especially for internet marketers. Now you can use these this system to set up buy links for your web design packages, your SEO packages, your products you're launching, whatever you want to sell, you can set up links and buy links through this platform and other affiliates, other product launchers and other people selling in your niche can promote your product as well and you can set up a commission and they can get paid and that's really where the power of kind of you know having your own products having your own services is because you can build an army of affiliates who are sending you money without you having to do anything other than handle whatever you do for each client whatever you're offering so I'm gonna quickly show you how to set up a buy link because I just had a buddy of mine he wants to set up a sales page and he wants affiliates coming to his web design package so I'm gonna make this real quick so hopefully it helps him hopefully it helps you guys so I'm here at JVZoo you have to sign up you know just register like normal on any website and you're sent here you'll be in the dashboard and you can see what's going on if you're affiliate you can search for other products uh, this is something I just promoted just a few minutes ago we sent 18 visitors so far two sales 25 bucks there um, now as a seller, these are the few products I have on JVZoo. I've just kind of transformed over to this uh, platform myself. And we're going to see how well it does. I feel like it's, it's doing pretty well so far. Um, and we're going to create a new product launch buy button for the relaunch of the Rabbit Fan Page project coming out uh, this upcoming Saturday. So in the sellers area, we're going to click add a product. Now allow sales, yes, if no, then they can't buy. Um, they're not gonna be able to buy yet now because we're gonna set the launch date a little later. Show in marketplace, this means if you want other affiliates to see your offer, sometimes you're gonna create buy links and you don't want affiliates to promote it. If that's a you know a special offer or something that you only want your list to see, you can say no and it won't show up in the marketplace. We want ours to be in the marketplace, we want affiliates to sign up. Now we have launch date. We're launching July 28th at 1 p.m. We're going to do a webinar at 12 and uh, launch right after that. Now, product name Rabbit Fan Page Project. Product price commission 75%. So that means any affiliate that makes a sale, they're going to get 75% of that sale. Look at 75% of the $7 and I'll get 25%. Which that's awesome because I just made a couple bucks with not having to do nothing. Someone just sent people and money to my bank account for free. So that's that's a cool thing about, you know, these services and products. All right, quantity, if you want to, you know, only sell 1000 and cuts off, you can put that there. Subscription if you want a monthly membership. Support, we're going to put my email, my support email. If you have a URL to send people, you can put it there. Landing page, now this is if you want to have a squeeze page to kind of pre-launch your product, which I am going to be doing this whole week, and we have a squeeze page for that. It's not created yet, but that's what we're creating this weekend, and we will be pushing people to that to pre-sell this launch on Saturday. Send all traffic to sales page after launch date. Yes, that's what we want to do. We have our own sales page, which would be the WSO post. We can leave that blank for now. WF backup, if you're not using it, we're going to use a download page. I'll put that in later so you don't see that. Our return period is 90 days. We want the product to be eligible for product of the day. Affiliate status, always do manual approve. Because if you do auto approve, just anyone will start promoting your product. And that, 
you really want to only choose good quality affiliates to promote your product because you don't want people just promoting it in any way possible to make money and ruining your name, ruining your reputation. And also if you're launching products like I do the first couple days, you want those conversions to be high. So you really only approve those close affiliates to you that you know are going to send quality traffic and keep that conversion up in the 15, 20, 30 percent range. So manual approval, notes to affiliates. I wrote something here. Just talk about the package, what it's done, what it can do. We have the OTO, a one time offer is a video series on Facebook, PPC. All right, archive note, not done yet. JV Marketplace, we want it to be a description again. Package is great for Facebook, list building, offline, niche marketing, and traffic. Traffic needs. This is what the viewer who's looking to buy will see. Now, primary category, social media, entertainment, health, internet marketing, social media. Secondary, I'd say... Survey submission tools, so let's see, niche marketing, that's probably second. Third category, affiliate marketing. All right, keywords, you know, Facebook, traffic, we'll say website, traffic. What else we got? We got niche marketing list building that works all right now integrate with autoresponder we're going to going to add every time someone buys we want them added to our our buyers list and we use aweber for this now the list is i think rfpp buyers at aweber.com so this would be the list name you have at aweber.com so let's go to aweber and make sure that is what we are doing what we're looking for rfpp all right rfpp buyers perfect so we have that rfpp buyers at aweber.com then we need the web form ID now what we do for that is we go to our web form we don't have one so we'll just create a new form for this who cares what it looks like it's not going to be showing up or anything we just need the ID so it can do the tracking stats for you so save step two go to step three I will install my form you see this number right there one zero two four one one five eight one eight that is your ID so you can just select that, copy it. Where am I? There we go. Web form ID, enter that in there. Now we're good to go. Every time someone buys, they will be added to my buyers list now. Oh. Now we want to make this a dime sale. Start price seven dollars. So the product price is actually max price. We want that to be nine ninety five. We're going to increase two cents every four sales. So with that, it's going to take 200 sales to increase a dollar. All right, now set up a JV. I don't have anyone I'm partnering with this. Set up a one-time offer. We do have a one-time offer. Facebook, PPC video we'll say rabbit fan page platinum series this is on Facebook PPC and traffic generation for the fan page OTO price we're gonna say seven bucks we're gonna keep it right there keep those OTOs really converting high OTO commission 50% 
sales page. You can use that same sales page we used before. All right, and then we want this thank you page. How does it can download? We don't have one for that yet. We'll just use that same page for now. Save product. Now all you have to do is add your buy button to your sales page. All right, here we are at the upcoming one-time offer sales page, and we need to add that product buy button. Right now, this is an old uh, sales page I was redoing, just adding the new pieces to it, and this is an old buy button. So I'm back here inside the seller's board here. We'll head to the seller's dashboard. And we can go ahead and grab our buy button. All right, first we want to click jump to OTO button because that's our one-time offer we have set up. Here we go, number four. Copy that, find our coding. Paste it. We're gonna save. Now we can go into the page to upload in the hosting here. And we want special. All right, there we go. The sales page is up. Buy button looks good. Now we're going to click it, check that it goes. Yes, we have the one time offer seven bucks increasing every 50 sales. And then we want to do that the same when we launch the WSO post. I'm going to add this buy link to the front end on there, verify, and we'll be good to go. We'll probably make a test post um, the day before, a couple days before, so we can verify that link. And after that, you can start making sales. You can start sending affiliates to your details page. As you can see, it's already created. That's as simple as it'll look. They'll see the sales page. Once it's up, they can get their affiliate links. They can see the commissions and all that great stuff. So it's as simple as that. You can start making money now on any service you're providing or any product you're selling and you know have an army of affiliates making that money for you. So... Get started now. It's a great way to get things rolling. Thanks. This is Travis Patel with Internet Biz Masters, and it's been much appreciated that you've watched this video.